What would you do if the power in your facility went out? In this video, I'll demonstrate how a UPS or uninterruptible power supply can help protect your electronic equipment from the nine most common power problems. A UPS is specifically designed to safeguard many different types of electronic equipment, ranging from your small desktop computers to your larger network servers, and ranging from your healthcare industry to your telecommunication markets. A UPS prevents hardware damage typically caused by surges and spikes. There are many different types of UPS systems, different makes, models, sizes, and some of them are specifically designed to condition incoming power. A UPS also protects IT equipment and other electrical loads from problems that are plaguing our electrical supply. The nine power problems are as follows. Power failure, a total loss of utility power. This can be caused by a number of events, including lightning strikes, downed power lines, grid over demands, accidents, and natural disasters. Power sag, short-term low voltage. This is triggered by the startup of large loads, utility switching, utility equipment failure, lightning, and power service that's too small for the demand. In addition to crashes, sags can damage hardware. Power surge or power spike. Short-term high voltage above 110% of nominal. This can be caused by a lightning strike and can send line voltages to levels in excess of 6,000 volts. A spike almost always results in data loss or hardware damage. For protection from these three power problems I just mentioned, a single phase offline standby UPS for non-critical applications would be the best solution. The next two types of power problems are under voltage or brownout. This is reduced line voltage for extended periods of a few minutes to a few days. This can be caused by intentional utility voltage reduction to conserve power during peak demand periods or other heavy loads that exceed supply capacity. Over voltage. Over voltage is the increased line voltage for extended periods of a few minutes to a few days. Over voltage is triggered by a rapid reduction in power loads, heavy equipment being turned off or by utility switching. The results can potentially damage hardware. For protection against the five power problems I just mentioned, a single phase line interactive UPS for more critical applications is the best solution. The next four types of power problems are electrical line noise, a high frequency waveform caused by EMI interference. This can be caused by either radio frequency interference or electromagnetic interference. These types of interferences are generated by transmitters, welding devices, certain printers, or lightning. Frequency variation, a change in frequency stability. This results from generator or small co-generator sites being loaded or unloaded. Frequency variation can cause erratic operation, data loss, system crashes, and equipment damage. Switching transient. Instantaneous undervoltage, or notch, in the range of nanoseconds. With a switching transient power problem, normal duration is shorter than a spike and generally falls in the range of nanoseconds. Harmonic distortion. Distortion of the normal line waveform, generally transmitted by nonlinear loads. Harmonic distortion is caused by switch mode power supplies, variable speed motors, and drives. Copiers and fax machines are examples of nonlinear loads. This type of power problem can cause communication errors, overheating, and hardware damage. For protection against all nine of these power problems I just mentioned, a three-phase online double conversion UPS for full power protection of critical applications would be the best solution. Selecting the right UPS can protect your IT equipment and other electrical loads from a wide range of problems coming from our electrical supply. That being said, Every consumer has different applications, different load requirements, different environments. So consult with Titan Power and we can help customize a solution to best fit your needs.